Hey everyone, welcome back, and we are in the realm of Skyrim. So, uh, last episode I ended on the note of uh, totally uh, killing some bandits, so, and I think that we're near the Riften area, but let's take a look. No, we are not. We're kind of in this upper marsh area where I guess it could technically be mistaken for the Riften area. So, but because this area is full of really awesome birch trees. Here, hold on one second. The microphone is in a weird spot again. I don't know how that keeps happening. Are you like bumping it or something? It just moves. There we go. It was like like right in front of my face and I had to like kind of like sit up out of my chair in order to see the, the screen so I kind of suck but you know it's fixed now so because this area has some really awesome looking birch trees I thought why not take a oh no you have got to be kidding me what the heck seriously Why is my clicking so off? Um, okay, well, this is not how I wanted this to go at all. Not even two minutes in. I'm already in the fight for my life, and I don't have any stamina. This is not going how I wanted it to. Okay, so... That just happened. I gotta get a new helmet. This, this helmet is ridiculous. Especially on a Kashyyyk. While wearing a mage's outfit. I only have it on because of the enchantment though. So. Which is. Um, the archery one. So I have that. Plus a bunch of other like fun perks. That just basically makes my archery really good. But not against frostbite spiders. Apparently. So. You know what? I'm feeling Nordic. Let's go. Wow. But before we do that. Okay, that wasn't part of the plan. But I saw kind of this cool little perch here. Look at that. That's cool. Ah, <sighs> there we go. That might be all I needed for, uh, screenshots. Alright, let's see what we got. Okay, that was a little bit of a weird, um, noise. Something's over. The Journal of Madrisi Dran on Agnavard and was something. Whispers of this ancient temple have been few and far between, and most real knowledge seems similar to that must be the temple name itself, buried and forgotten. 
Yet every story or legend I hear all seem to speak of immeasurable riches found deep within. Great treasure awaits for the worthy adventurer, said one old fool after many false flirtations and tankards of mead. Though he may have had been a nuisance, his information matches most of my research, specifically the location of an F of an Angar. <laughs> Carvunde, whatever, Evagrunda, whatever. Tomorrow I will hire a mining team to assist me in my excavation and head towards the ruin. By this time next month, I shall be rich. If only I could pronounce the name of it. Okay. So we have our backstory there. Looks like they all gathered up and got ready and headed in. The question is, where is the entrance? Looks like there's like some sort of path leading up here. Or not. Okay, they had to go in from somewhere. Is there something up in those ruins up here that I'm missing? Probably. Yep, cave. Ah. I think that might be our, um, no, you're the writer. Of course I'm covered. I'm on the verge of incredible, we were excavating this old tomb when we opened a chamber full of corpse. Well, probably not in any case. If I can't get past the creatures in that room, I can't recover the treasure. I need more men. Maybe I can help you. Hey, that's not a bad idea. You look like you could handle yourself against these beasts. I'll tell you what. You help me get the treasure, and I'll split it with you. Deal? Deal. Excellent. With my brains and... First, I need you to clear the main chamber. Oh, I didn't see you there. Shut up. Yes, you did. Whoa. <sighs> Okay, nothing down there for me to loot, but... Let's take it slow. There's one more back there. He's not very happy with me. There we go. dealing with I'm not gonna go back and talk to her about this I'm just gonna go and do it all right we're dealing with a multi-room I remember this one this one has you go in a huge circle before you can open up that gate and the first one starts in here nope never mind um oh no she has the key that's what it is. So I have to go back and talk to her. Have you killed them all yet? Then we've no time to lose. Follow me. God, I hate you. Don't fall behind. Why are you in such a rush? The treasure isn't going anywhere. We're the only ones here. 
No one's going to come up behind us. Where are we going? What are you doing? You should have led with that. Hey, here's the key thing, you know. All right. Let's take this slow and steady with precision and aptitude. Um, let's use uh, let's use the ancient Nord arrows. They do a little bit more damage. So that should help to ensure that uh, they die the first time. Ah, they tricked me. We're going to be in here for a while. Okay. Um, there we go. I still can't believe that I almost died to a frostbite spider in the first, like, two minutes of the episode. Headshot. The stairs must be pretty close to here. So he's probably going to come up from right there. Nope, I take that back. Didn't want to die from uh, spikes, so I had to jump off. Now, where did I peg that freaking dragger from? So I got shot here. Oh, there's his body. I see it. It's down here. Look at that. It's a clean skull shot. I wish this mechanical keyboard was louder. Oh, shoot. Why won't you die? Potions. Magic of poison. Are you serious? You resisted a magic of poison? Boy. That's cheating. Granted, poisons aren't really that fair either, but whatever. I didn't mean to pick that shield up. Is that technically a peril or is it? Yeah, it's a peril. Okay. Okay, so I think that's what I had to do for, uh, that one, maybe?
Yeah, because this was closed, so that one had to have uh, opened it up. There's someone else here. I can hear his footsteps. Dropped him. Oh. <sighs> Next time, aim for the head, as Thanos would say. I see coffins. My greed is going to be the death of me. Oh boy. Mr. Mick, I'm on the bridge, but I just saw my enemy, so I have to run all the way down. It's going to come after me now. But watch me drop him. Oh crap. He stopped moving. Well, at least we know the temple set up now. There shouldn't be any traps in between here and there. Yep, we're good. All right. doing some kind of patrol. Doesn't really matter now though because he's dead, but <sighs> rib shot, cool. All right, there we go. That's one. And now for the other. So now that we're this deep in the video, um, if you're a new viewer, then uh, welcome. But if you're, but if you're a um, a, uh, a previous returning viewer, I kind of wanted to give a little bit of an apology for yesterday's video, the Subnautica one in particular, because I had gone through the entire video, 
without realizing the graphic settings were on low. Well, I did realize they were low, but, um, you know, that happened. So I wanted to give an apology for producing a low quality video as if any of them that I produce are high quality, but whatever. Oh, sh shoot. But, um, yeah, I, I just wanted to say sorry for uh, disappointing, basically, in producing something that wasn't up to standard. So, hopefully you can look past that and uh, continue watching and not unsubscribe. That'd be great. I am currently at 52. So, I have more videos uploaded than I do subscribers. And uh, I think I know why. I'm going to play with that theory a little bit. And it might have to do with the way I'm doing tags. Because I think I'm doing tags the worst way possible. So, oh crap. That's a restless boy. Shoot. Can you stop? I ain't falling for that weak shit, boy. Oh, crap. <sighs> Will you help me get back my golden claw? That's a fun quest. Like, that's like a good, like, entry-level quest for Skyrim is the golden claw. So you learn a lot about the game mechanics and the temple mechanics and a lot of fun stuff through that quest. Like, you know, how to use the special doors and, you know, all that stuff. All right. There we go. <sighs> Does unlocking a chest consume a lockpick? Nah, maybe, I don't know. I know it does for when you, like, give it to, like, a follower. But I don't know about, uh, the player. Well, I just set off a ton of traps and probably just emptied out like 500 poison darts into the air, so that's great. getting a ton of uh, Nordic arrows out of this, so. You're moving, I see that. Oh crap. Maybe not. Uh, what? Dude. Hey. Whoa. I'm still a little upset that Subnautica was uh, put into low graphics by accident. I can't just go and record the, like, you know, redo the entire video because it's already been, like, you know, done and saved over. So it's not like I can just go back. And that is why I 
have multiple copies of the saves in Minecraft. Is so if something like that happens, I can avoid it. But I can't do that in Subnautica. I can do that in Skyrim. I can do that in most games, even in Kingdoms and Castles. Which was how I was able to um, recover the fact that I deleted all of the audio for episode 8 beforehand. You've got to be kidding me. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Okay. And like a bunch of free archery uh, points from uh, no scoping Draugr. Crap. There we go. Not used to aiming for targets that are laying down. No, I didn't mean to pick that up. And to get the other one. Seriously? There we go. <sighs> that is way too long. I need to find some copies of the Lust Gargonian made to read to you guys. Cause that's that's totally uh totally uh high quality content right there. I don't even know where to find copies of that. I need to like do some digging. Alright, now I'm gonna deal with you and your nonsense. You're gonna run in there and die. Boy, does that suck. Boy, does that really suck. Five gold is your treasure. Come on. I'm not just gonna leave a corpse unlooted. Come on. Yes. want it. Alright. Wow, that was a pretty deep stairwell. Oh crap, boss battle. Anything cool in here? I'll take that. I'll take those.
There we go. <sighs> okay. Now comes the part where I try to find a way to get out of here without having to backtrace. Because I backtraced it. Looks like that's not going to happen. Oh, wait a minute. This is a super, super tiny temple. Like, it's just in one way, not the next. Uh. Cool. That was easy. That did not take nearly as long as I thought it was. I was kind of worried this would be like a two-episode ordeal. But nope. Got that cleared pretty quickly. In and out. Let's see. Well, still got a lot of uh, room to explore here. But until then, I wanted to thank you for making it this far into the video. I highly appreciate the fact that you uh, stuck through. Either you're sleeping or you're still awake. Either way, thank you. Thank you. I, I really can't, you know express my gratitude um also to uh, those of you who are on tingles right now watching my content uh thank you you guys have managed to get me uh, 18 cents so that's real cool so thank you and yeah thanks for watching everyone have a fantastic